going to jack that up. Ay, ay, ay. All right. Uh, let's close out with this. The Monday night football booth has been settled on. Um, they, they're leaving the door open for Kirk Herbstreet and Chris Fowler to call NFL games. But uh, as it stands right now, um, we're going to have Steve Levy, Brian Greasy, and Lewis Riddick. And I am totally okay with that. I, I like this booth a lot. That's, I, I mean, obviously, Levy has done uh, fill-in games a couple of times here and there. Um, Brian He's Greasy, a pro. He's yeah. done it forever. He's not going to get in there and screw it up. He's not going to get in there and make it a mockery. Yeah. Lewis Riddick, is, he's a pro as well. I yeah, love listening fine. to him. He's a great commentator. Um, and then Brian Greasy has been doing this for a long time, too. He's done college football and the NFL. I, I like all these guys. Like None of them is a, a standout, like, oh, it's Tony Romo or it's Peyton no. Manning or whatever. It no. doesn't have to be. So long as they are good at their the job. Booth. Yeah, stability. That's all we're looking for. And honestly, I mean, this, this may just be a one-year thing, but as it stands, these are all ESPN employees anyway. I mean, who knows, right? So we'll we'll see what happens. I think they're going to be pretty good because, I mean, they've done it before. I've enjoyed listening to them call games. I think this is going to be just fine. Um, the way it was stated, it says, uh, uh, Levy, Greasy, and Riddick are slated to host the first Monday night football game this season, while Herb Street and Fowler are currently slated to host the second matchup, according to Miller's reporting. Uh, Miller does note, if college football season is canceled, this could change. Um, so, I mean... We'll see. Like we 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 were going to see Chris Fowler and Kirk Herbstreet uh, probably do some NFL games for ESPN this year, but the main booth is going to be Levy, Greasy, and Riddick, and I'm okay with that. I'm okay yeah. with it. Uh, Terry said, "Yeah, 120 games at Wrigley are as close to heaven as you can get." Uh, he said, "If it's a good game on Monday night, anyone could call it. Just hope they actually have good games." Yeah, that's true. Uh, Matt Miller said, "ESPN used to be great with Joe uh, with John Miller and Joe Morgan for baseball and radio." And Monday Night Football used to be great, too. I don't know what happened. Well, I mean, they they got cute. <laughs> that's what happened. Um, Damien said, that's better than listening to Joe Buck and Aikman. Yeah, I think so. I mean, I, 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 I like Joe Buck. I, I, like, I like Buck. I mean, Aikman's been hitting the head too many times. Yeah, but I, 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 I can like take or Buck. leave Aikman, but uh, but Buck, I think, is, is pretty good. I don't really like Buck on, uh, on baseball. Like, I, I like him on everything, but... At, maybe it's just me. I don't know. I'm I'm not a huge uh, fan of his doing baseball games, but I mean he does. He sounds just like a a baseball commentator. I mean, you know. Either way, Ben said anything's better than John Gruden. Yes, <laughs> literally anything is better than John Gruden. That's I love that these guys know you well enough that uh that they'll jump in with that here and there. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here. You guys have been fantastic. Thank you for another wonderful week. I'm glad that we've got Chris back. Uh, we are ready to rock and roll into college football. Go over to sbrpicks.com. Go to sportsbookreview.com. Knock this stuff out. Make sure you're subscribed to their YouTube channel to get our college football content. Our first video goes up tomorrow, August 1st on Saturday. So go and check it out. We'll uh, we'll have as much it content. It might be a video you folks don't need. If it's the yeah. intro video, then. Yeah, it, I think it's, it's going to be the intro. Y'all know, watch it anyway. Um, hey, Terry jumped in. He said, Gary, you're right. Buck sucks at calling baseball. Um, <laughs> I don't know that he sucks, but, it, you know, I, I, he's not my favorite. Uh, but with that said, we're getting out of here. Go to winningcureseverything.com. Go to sbrpicks.com. And make sure you are subscribed to our podcast and leave a nice five-star review. Share the show out. Click that like button on the video. All these wonderful things. You guys have been wonderful all week. Thank you for jumping in the chat and helping us drive the conversation. Chris, is there anything else we need to hit? That's it, brother. That is it. Everybody have a wonderful weekend. Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. We'll see you on Monday. Thanks for checking out Winning Cures Everything. If you want to keep up with us, hit subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. Visit the website at winningcureseverything.com or you can like us on Facebook or follow us at Winning Cures, at Gary WCE, or at Chris B. Giannini on Twitter. Share out the show, leave a nice review, 